why. <laughs> Hello and welcome back to the most amazing channel on the internet. I'm your host Rebecca Felgate and today we're talking about the top 10 scary dark web videos that should have stayed secret. And honestly, I'm wishing that I'd not made this video because researching it has made me feel pretty sick. Please guys leave me a happy comment about something nice like a delicious snack or kittens so basically when I read them I can forget all about the horror of this video. Thank you. Also while you're down there why don't you leave this video with a thumbs up if you're the crazy kind of sicko that likes this content, share it with a fellow crazy sicko friend and stay subscribed for more crazy sick videos. Also if you guys want to connect with me on social media there is a link to my Instagram in the description box. Hello just me interrupting my own video because I can't wait to tell you guys about Joyride. Joyride is a fun filled quiz and trivia app. My favourite part is Music Mania which is a name that tune game. You have 10 seconds to identify a song as it plays and if you get all 9 of them then you win actual money. And you can also play things like Film Frenzy on the app which tests your movie knowledge by asking you to guess the film based on the scene. There are also celebrity quizzes if you're great at knowing your Kims from your Kendalls, your Swifts from your Menages. Think of the app as like a game show in your pocket and you can be a contestant whenever you want. You can play with your friends and video chat as part of a team and also you can join shows streaming live throughout the day and play with other people across the world. One really 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 cool game is Top Pop where you can win by picking the answer you think that most people are going to pick live. If this app sounds like all of the joy you need then you can download it free on iOS and Android and you can subscribe for further access. I've placed a link in the description box so you guys can download the app and also get playing right away. Coming into number 10 we have Blank Room Soup. Blank Room Soup is purportedly a dark web video leaked onto this surface web. Now I can't verify that but the video is hella terrifying. We see a blindfolded man sitting at a table crying and eating what looks like noodle soup. A big giant costume comes waltzing in with a scary kind of silent creepy atmosphere. He comes and comforts the man and the man starts crying and gagging and soon enough another big costume of a featureless man comes in and pats him on the back too. The video is just one minute long but it is absolutely terrifying. Theories surrounding the video are rife not least on reddit. Some say that the big costumes we see here were stolen from an actor who had something to do with this man's capture. All the theories seem to indicate that the soup eater is in some kind of peril. Some even say he's being forced to eat the soup that's laced with poison, meaning he'll die soon. Others are convinced that this is an art project. Let's have a final look shall we? Coming in at number 9 we have Hamburger Lady. Now she is not as fun as she sounds. Who is the Hamburger Lady? I don't know. All I do know is that she is horrifying and I like the sound of her. Hamburger Lady is a video that surfaced from the dark web 3 or so years ago. Now I have no idea how long it was below the surface for but unfortunately it's here now. The video is spooky and not just visually but audibly too. It's filled with chaotic and disorientating sounds as well as a jumble of sentences, signs and signals. The captions spin a dark tale saying that the mysterious hamburger lady is burned from the waist up and she can't hold on to things. The video also discusses the tubes in her arms and flashes up scary images of a girl in a mask. I have no idea what it means and honestly I don't care to. Coming in at number 8 we have abducted and imprisoned. This is allegedly a deep web video showing a young woman who has seemingly been kidnapped. As with a lot of so called dark web videos there isn't a lot of information here but we see that the video was supposedly shot on the 14th of August and it starts with a girl startling awake on the floor when a box falls to the ground. She later holds up a sign to the camera which we assume is some kind of stream. She says she doesn't have any water and she begs for some more. She also appears to be wearing a shirt with the numbers 000656 written on them. Later the video ends as the barricade she has pushed against the door starts being broken down. It seems that someone is breaking in and she is deathly afraid of who that may be. Where this video came from no one can tell you or no one will tell you anyway. Some people of the internet are hailing it as a fake while others are pretty terrified. Coming into number 7 we have Corpus Christus. So this translates to the body of Christ and I am not feeling this video's vibes although I guess I'd be surprised if I was feeling any deep web video isn't really my bag. My bag's mainly filled with cute puppy videos and videos from my friend Molly Burke. Anyway this video is creepy. It shows images of men and I don't know maybe the same man being tested on. A man's face changes 
changes from young to like weird and haggard and I can't really tell if this is real life or animation or stop motion or a combination of all of them. Here is one of my least favourite clips. Things get creepy in the background too. The video culminates with the experimentation getting even worse and worse with like a mouth cage thing. There are some wires in the head as well, I'm not sure what they're about. And finally, the corpus, the body, is ripped open at the chest by a strange spidery machine and to be honest, I'm not a fan. This next video is short but really scary, be warned. At number 6 we have the unknown creature grabs a baby. So this video is just 26 seconds long and all of the action happens in the last 2 seconds. Before that we're watching a video of a baby in what looks like a crib or something. The child seems like it's around the yearish mark, although it's quite hard to tell because the quality of the video isn't that great. The child is goo goo and gaga to itself when all of a sudden, well, watch. If we play that back, I do notice that the scary hand slips through the back of the cot just before the baby is grabbed and stolen away. Now the thing that worries me about this video is that I can't see a cut, I really hope it's fake because even if this isn't a real monster or creature, grabbing a baby like that just isn't okay. Coming into number 5 we have Sad Satan. I feel like Sad Satan could sponsor most amazing top 10, we've mentioned this video quite a lot. Sad Satan is purportedly a dark web video game that comes with a curse, although I'm not sure that what that curse is, it's just cursed. Nondescript curses are my favourite. Some Redditors who have attempted to decode the game say that it is providing instructions to kill. Others also think that when the game was originally on the dark web, it gave details of the player's whereabouts to a malicious group who could then track the gamer. YouTube channel Obscure Horror Corner lived up to their name when they shared a scary screen recording of the game playthrough on their channel and honestly, it looks really intense. Far too intense for me, I think Spyro the Dragon is the crux of my gaming. It also sounds intense and like honestly I don't like that. In the dark web video game, the player is walking down a shady alley and horrible radio signals start coming through. During the gameplay, from time to time, a blank screen appears with strange markings. Finally, at the end of the game it cuts to a black screen in which the phrase suffering doesn't end appears. Great, let's just hope that that's a dramatic effect. Coming in at number 4 we have the grifter. I do not like a close up eyeball shot, no I don't. Not only is the grifter said to be from the dark web, it is also said to be cursed. Only a small section of the original video has reportedly been leaked to the surface web, and if the 67 second clip we can see is anything to go by, then you don't want to see the whole thing. But like, actually. According to 4chan, the most credible of sources, if you watch the whole video, you're at risk of being killed. Jolly D. The 4chan post said that the video came into circulation in 2008, and that those who watched it experienced nausea and nightmares. Some claim to have had their souls altered. A creepy pasta based on the footage claims that those who have watched the full video have been killed. Great. So I'm not sure if that's the case, I'd still say that this video is probably nothing more than a creepy video, but it just isn't worth the risk. Coming into number 3 we have Cemetery. This video warns viewers not to watch it as it will enter their unconscious and having seen this monstrosity, I think that we should all have heeded the video's advice. The video is just shy of 2 minutes long and is all kinds of religious and cemetery kind of satanic footage. What it means, I don't really know and what it is doing on the dark web, well I'd rather not speculate. Shall we have another look? Go on then. <laughs> but I actually really don't like how this video ends. Coming in at number 2 we have Obedeci a la Morsa. Weirdly, it seems that the title of this video is Spanish for Obey the Walrus. What walrus? Who is the walrus? I am the walrus! Cuckoo Kachu. No, Rebecca now isn't the time for singing the Beatles, although I wish it was because it would mean I'm not in this video. Now actually is the time for freaking out because this video is too creepy for words. Although actually this isn't the most amazing top 10 hand gestures so I guess I'll try and use words to describe this dark web creep fest. So basically, word on this surface web is that La Morsa is a Latin cult. Is this their indoctrination video? I don't know. The video starts off with an animated face singing a nursery rhyme and then all of that gets distorted and we see like kaleidoscope colours. We then see what looks like an emaciated transgender dancer with horrifyingly jarring movements and wide eyes. They're also wearing a clown hat which doesn't fly with me. The scariest moment is when the music cuts and this happens to the sound of a clock ticking. What is this 
walrus and why is it here? Now this video has had over 25 million views, are there 25 million people in the walrus cult now? Finally coming into number 1, heavy 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 audience warning, this is really horrifying, I don't like it, but this is the number 1, it's a Russian snuff. I don't even know how to begin pronouncing the name of this video, here it is written down on the screen for you. Can anyone from Russia watching translate this, Should, would I have read the title and been like ok not gonna watch it because if so, knowing Russian would have been really handy. This video is extremely long and extremely disturbing, it's over an hour and a half and I can't even show you the worst parts because we simply can't air this content on YouTube. I can't speak Russian so I can't tell you what exactly is going on but to me it seems like Russian prisoners are forced to defile themselves on camera and then kill each other. At one point a man in military wear poos on a plate and actually it sounds funny but trust me it really really isn't. The video ends in a lot of bloodshed and I have to say it is one of the worst videos I've ever seen in my life and no part of me doubts its authenticity, I wish I could go back in time and never ever ever watch it, but you clicked on this video so you asked for this. Honestly I'm feeling really sad right now, I just want to talk about Harry Potter and have a cup of tea, this is all I want from life, is this too much to ask, please, ah. please do leave me a happy comment because I need to read them, I really do, and before I go I'm going to read some of your comments to cheer myself up, although the video the comments I'm reading from is the top 10 scary dentist story so <laughs> fingers crossed. Oh also shout out to the guy in the street, Emil, that said hi to Danny and I earlier in the rain, you made my day. Ok, scary dentist stories comments. Our super amazing channel member Andrea Hopper said, Ah, oh, Rebecca you look so pretty today, thanks. The hair and earrings I'm loving together, oh I'm wearing the same earrings in this video. She continued by saying I actually love my dentist, my dentist is super amazing at her job and she is actually human if you understand what I mean, that's to be honest good to know, all those demon dentists out there, honestly from watching these videos though you would think that is the case. She continued by saying I can just chat with her like we have real conversations with both musicians which has been fun to talk about, genuinely love what she does. Amazing, shout out to this babe of a dentist. Finally Zoe Murta wrote my mum is a dental nurse and I love her, if you're reading this, love you mum. Aww, see this is what I needed, just some love to end this horrifying video. Like where's the love web actually, I'm not even sure I want to know the answer to that. Good, while I think about that, you just keep on liking, sharing, subscribing and I'll see you another day for another episode of something deep dark and scary. So thank you once again for our video sponsor Joyride, if you guys want to test your knowledge and have fun at the very same time then make sure you check out the link in the description box. I'm Rebecca Felgate, will I still be sane in 10 years? Probs not, but never mind. See you soon.